Hi. Okay. Bother. That is Austin Knight. I've heard of him. My day is fine. Drop went well. Shit's good. My allergies decided to kick in as soon as I pressed the live button or like a minute before and I was just like, mmm. It's like, all right, good, cool. Alexandra from Tacoma. This is yours, your first today. Also, real quick, gotta say thank y'all for another sold out drop. Literally at 10.01, or at, it was either 10 or 10.01. It was like, damn, zero left. Like, not even any left to hold for later. So, thank you. Normally we hold back like a few of each size just in case there's like issues or we want to save some for the eventual pop-up or whatever, but yeah. Wait, wait, I'm just sticking up here. I knew I was missing something. Austin, my dad is insulting you to my face. Yo, your dad has bad taste. Or he's projecting and he secretly wants to kiss me. All right. My money's on secret kiss. All right, Alexandra, you know what has to happen. I have to not dox you. Show your package what's what. Okay. I am on the ball with my high def shipping. Your mom is right. All right. Another medium for Josh. Let's go, Josh, in East Hartford. I feel like this one is already going. I know we're only two packages in, but it's already going quicker than last week because I was getting back in the hang of it. Also, I said on the Twitter that, uh, on the high def Twitter, that there was a few drops left with this packaging, like the, the wrapping paper. However, I was wrong. This is the last one. So, next drop we'll have the new paper and I'm super stoked on that because I was thinking about how people um, I've seen people online like on Twitter and shit post their like rap I'll show you Josh I've seen people um, post their wrapping paper like this like on their wall or like frame it or whatever. And it is cool. Like, I think it's sick. Um, when, wait, here we go. But uh, I kind of had that in mind when, like, when we were like, okay, what's the next one? Cause we are almost out of this. You're gonna like it. It's gonna be tight. It's gonna look really good on a wall. That's what I'm saying. Are you touring 2023? Yeah but less. I think, I think be able to do cooler shit if we do less. And I'm just more creative at home. It's harder to be creative on the street. Oh wait, all right, well. Spencer. Here. Spencer. Stickers. Mmm. We did tour so much this year and we're leaving again in like a week and a half for the My Chemical Romance tour. <sighs> that shit's crazy. Um I'm so excited. Like, I'm tired, but I would tour with them 365 days of the year. 
Spencer in Pittsburgh. What are you doing in August? You just woke up. Fuck you. Put Gerard on a song. Gerard can be on any song he wants. Gerard can be the singer of Water Parks. I'll just play guitar. I don't fucking care. Also, I figured out how to wrap this better. It only took me until we were like out of this paper. There we go. And this is going to. Who we got? I'm on my way to you, but I still have to. Caitlin in Campbell, Texas. I don't even know where that is, and that's where we're from. Campbell, Texas. All right. Stickers. Okay. Let's make sure the sticker wasn't on already. Otherwise, some people would know where you live. Also, I think we know what next week's drop is going to be. It's something that you've been wanting for a really long time. They did play it on Radio 1. They played Self-Sabotage a lot on there, actually. You gotta... You gotta tune in and go go thank Jack for us. Kylie. Kylie from California. Oh man. So a lot of times when I first walk outside and I see the sun, I just start sneezing. Let there be light. Uh I just start sneezing, and today was no exception. Um, all right, Kylie, let's get you some stickers. Pose for a pick. All right, take a screenshot. Go. Kylie, need the paper. I am allergic to the outside. It's called, what is it? It's like photo something something, not photosynthesis. <laughs> but it's photo, fuck. I've looked it up like a handful of times trying to explain that it's real. But look up, like Google, I sneeze when I look, when I, when I see the sun and it'll, it'll show you, but I deal with that all the time. Kylie. Okay. Okay. Next we have, I need to shave. Carly. Harley from Burbank. Let's go. I love Burbank. I've considered living in Burbank. It's very nice. Um, stickers. Wait, so what do y'all want for for next week? Because I have an idea. But I'm just going to see if we have the same idea. My hair does not look cool today. This won't go down.
Wait, did I put stickers in here? Carly, I think you're getting extra. All right. I don't have a hairbrush, actually. Striped sweater. Like, because I do have this boy right here. See, like, Honestly, okay, so it looks cool as fuck, but the best part of this is kind of the inside. Like, I just can't explain, like, how crazy it feels. Like, it's, it's like, very, very thick, and, like, you don't need, uh, like, an undershirt with it the way you might normally. But God damn, it's so pretty. Like, this is easily one of the best quality things from high def, like, ever. I hope it's focusing okay. The other one is the nicest sweater I own. Hell yeah. Yeah, this is definitely one of the best things. Um, anyway. Pregnancy tests. I feel okay. So, pregnancy tests and condoms. I did try and make condoms for the band. Actually, no, not tried. I did make condoms for the band. However, I feel like we got them in early 2019, and when they actually came, like, so I wanted them to have the album art on, uh, like, you know, on each one, like, on each package. Like, we had. Cluster Double Dare Entertainment. That's like what we had at the time. And um, when they actually, uh, also I wanted our faces like on the condoms themselves. Like so when they would blow up, it was just like our heads. That part didn't happen. They actually came, when they showed up, they were like red. They looked like, you know, like doggy dicks. But like, uh, uh, they were so fucking like janky that I was just like, we cannot put these out people will get pregnant, 100%. Um, anyway, Elise, this is for you. Um, but I'm saying, like, they were so fucking bad. So they showed up to the New York date of the tour. Oh, shit. Not only am I throwing your stuff, I'm stepping on it. Um, I'm saying, like, they came to the New York show, and they were, like, in trash bags. So I was already like, oh, this is not good. And, uh, um... No, we're not going to play at a water park. Fuck you. Um, and it was literally just like paper folded over with a staple, like closing it together. And then like a con, like a, like a pre-made, like whatever condom inside. And they were so bad. And I was just like, oh my, cause it, it, it was like, when I say paper, I mean like it felt like computer paper and the noise, huh? Um, it felt like computer paper that was just like folded over and then stapled and then just like a red condom inside. They were really bad. And I was just like, Hey, I wanted to do this really bad. These are so fucking awful and people are going to get condoms. I mean, I'm sorry. People are going to have babies. So, so we definitely cannot release these to the general public or we'll probably get sued. Or there would be a lot of babies named Jeff from 2019, but spelled badly. All right, um, please. Let's see what we got. 
Honestly, a Trojan collab would be way better than whatever fucked up company that we used. Police. See, I'm not, I don't, I probably wouldn't make a phone case either because this is supposed, I mean, a phone case is more like merch material, you know what I mean? Let's see. Hide a pill case. Damn. Making that kind of like, like with like, I don't know, like some kind of gem in it, like opal or like. Or like emerald or something. It would be so sick. Those are two of my favorite stones right now. Yeah, if you existed because of a broken water parts common, like, I don't know, if that was me, I, I would feel like I wouldn't have much to hold on to. I'd be like, I exist because some shitty merch company Actually, no, not some. I know which one, but I can't say it. Um, made the worst condoms of all time, and now I just have to be here, like, reading things online and asking people, I don't know, what do you want to eat? I would probably assassinate all three of us. Lindsay... This is probably the best I've packed one, and it's because I wasn't thinking about it. They are working on... Yo, they... they Not almost real, they were real. They were real for me. I held them and I said, uh-uh. I had to be quality control because nobody else used to be. I saved y'all from shitty merch so many times. Like, I'd be like, this hoodie needs to be this color and made of like this blank or whatever. And they'd send it through on like the shittiest thing, wrong color, all this stuff. I was literally your only line of defense. So you're welcome. Uh, stickers for Caitlin in Rancho Cucamonga. <sighs> That is the funniest city name ever. I like it. Hey, you're welcome. Thanks for saying thank you. Oh god, I'm gonna sneeze. No, I'm not. Caitlin. <laughs> you know what? I think I want to go live a little bit on the high def page. How many of y'all are on that? And how many of y'all need to be accepted? Tampons and condoms. I think I need to update my phone because right now it actually won't let me accept anybody into any private account. Like, because I've got, you know, obviously high def, but then I even have like the Austin 3000 one. And that one currently, like, when I click on the request thing, no, oh shit, normally you either see, who was about to get two just now? Yasmin. Uh, so when I click it to see requests right now, they are, like, normally it says, like, confirm or deny or whatever it is, or accept, decline, and those buttons are just not there. So... I think I need to update my phone, because either way, I can't accept anybody. 
I'm not even trying to be like extra exclusive right now. Instagram is gatekeeping high def from you. Um, anyway, should the blue and green one be next week? Because I am strongly considering that. Everybody else, see ya.